Yeah, it's green and black, folks. Take note and don't worry about the sound because the idea that uh, you want to be able to hear the information. Uh, quit complaining, shut up and sit down and listen to the truth. That's why you're here to begin with. So, uh, and you'll keep getting the sound. So you're just going to have to put up with <coughs> a little bit of annoying noise. And uh, you're not the tech here, I am. So you get sound. So here we are at the weather. Actual, factual. And this is Fahrenheit, okay. I have a site that shows Canadian weather with uh, Fahrenheit, okay. The number one thing is, the first thing that caught me off, uh, caught me on guard immediately was our 50 degree temperature that we've got right here, okay. 50, 50, and if you noticed last night too when I was pointing, when they did the video, they tried to move my pointer away from the objects in space that I was pointing at. Scatter. So anyway, here we go with uh, showing you why we have such hot, warm temperature. And basically, you can decide whether modification or not. It doesn't really matter. It's up to you. And then we'll move around here, and what do we see? Very unusual. That's not the norm, okay? And I don't need to zoom in on this. You can zoom in on that yourself. It'll mess up my screen. We'll show you some earthquakes, too. You'll see the fires. It's no joke. There's fires. I have a 3.0, 3.0. We're just going to go around these quakes here. I'm even going to shut up. I'm just going to scroll around. Show you what's going on. Nice swarm there. That's all you really got to worry about. I mean, not even worry about. But concerned about. Take a look at. Uh, you'll see fires all over the place. This is all today. The 24th right hand lower corner always got the central standard time there for you I move around a little bit but central standard time for quite a bit so swarm of quakes out in Cali so I won't get into them too much there as you've seen these two here that we've looked at okay got these two up here Uh, we're going to go back to a moisture in the United States here in a minute. Get all that stuff out there. Then we'll basically zoom out here in a second. We got fire out there. We're over in Japan. Come down to Australia and France down here in a second. Lots of action going on around there. Watch this interesting line we got right here. Look at all the fires. They got heat like crazy. And then they get, uh, whether it's geoengineered or not, they're getting crazy rain and hail off and on too in between all the heat. And so they get the, the all the funnels, tornado funnels that I showed you. But basically, we'll try to get this map to zoom out real fast here. Let me go over and give you some, uh, why we get let that zoom out so we get a farther away shot and get this. And this is today. The color code will give you the speed of the wind. I'm just showing you that just because I got it. So Basically, I'm going to look at some other conditions here. You can always freeze this and look at this. This is today. A couple quick comments. Weather modification because no matter what, this is not a norm of wind at all. This is, this is manufactured. Okay, It's not the normal jet stream, not the normal wind. Okay. This also here, and then let's back that up and see what we've already looked at. Precipitation for the day, and then give you code there, that's your code. That's an inch, okay? That's an inch and a quarter, okay? And then three quarters of an inch, half an inch, quarter of an inch, on down. And up to four inches, okay? Color code, okay? Now watch. See that little yellow right there? Let's go back to showing you. Two and a quarter inches, two and a half inches, okay? And you can see a little bit of yellow right there, okay? 
yellow right there. So that's what they got there. And then you can see around here they always show you show you every little inch of precipitation. Okay? And just back up the video. Weather modification. It's right here. Also created that over there. Okay. So check it all out. And we got all these quakes around. It looks like we got a storm over there. Tropical or whatever they call it when it's in the Indian Ocean. We got a storm there. Bold wind. Okay. So that's going on. So the Philippines and stuff and everything would be end up getting this. So cruise around here. All these fires are real, they're all there. So all this is going on. So these are all earthquakes, you should know that by now. Okay. It looks like this one's this here's just fresh from Hawaii because I was just there a few minutes ago. At least they're showing the information I guess on the zoom out, I guess. So I'm gonna zoom in a little earlier, they're just showing the fire over there. So there's a fire on in Hawaii somewhere too. So because that's what that there on the outside is, that's a fire. There's fires going on over there in Hawaii. So I'm gonna give you this here, let's scooting it up. As you can see, the new Madrid, the new Madrid, the new Madrid. You got to keep an eye on the new Madrid. And like I was trying to show you on the new Madrid, and then you got your weather modification over here. Weather modification. More than likely caused that, and probably this 